I've been practicing for this all week, but I'm still not very good. Are you ready, Steve? It might, I'm, I'm thinking positively, I think that I can serve the whole, no, maybe even right down to the merchants. Are you ready? What do you reckon, Mum? Do you think I can get it that far? What on earth do you think you're doing? Well, I text Ben and he said that this week Jesus is the king who serves. <laughs> so I was trying to be more like Jesus. You're trying to be like Jesus. Well, he sets the best the king example. who serves. Okay. Well, could you tell me, hello, how is this, that serving like that, like Jesus? Well, tell us serve. Oh, goodness gracious. Okay. Hang on. You're a bit mixed up. Wouldn't be the first time. Jesus is the king. Mm -hmm. Okay. Don't and in the Bible, tennis. sorry. Don't kings play tennis? Well, I don't know that Jesus played. Well, I did think done. that maybe not back then. They probably didn't have tennis rackets. No, no. I think you're just a little bit mixed up, Jess. So just, just hang on a minute. Um, Ben's going to tell us about how Jesus is our king and how he served. And he actually served his disciples. Did you know that? And do you know how he served them? He washed their feet. Well, kings don't normally wash other people's feet. Well, no, that's what I thought. I can't imagine Queen Elizabeth getting down and washing people's feet. I can't imagine ScoMo, who's not a king, he's, he's, uh, he, he's the prime minister of this land. I can't imagine him washing people's feet. No, me neither. But Jesus did. The Bible actually says he poured water into a basin and began to wash his disciples' feet and he dried them with a towel that was tied around his waist. Can you believe that? I found it really incredible. So, so that's the kind of serving you mean. Yes. So doing things for other people. When we love Jesus... We want to follow Jesus and we want to serve like Jesus did. Not tennis, but serving like Jesus. Right. And that means it might be, you might be helping mum to clean the table. Or when mum says, could you go and get that for me? You go and get it, you're serving her. And we can serve all sorts of people, but Jesus... He set an example of serving. Amazing, isn't it? All right, let's okay. pray. Yep. Close your eyes. Lord Jesus, thank you that you, but that you died for us on the cross for our sins and that you are a king that served and we ask that you help us to listen to Ben explain that today and to be servers in our life to serve other people and set an example that way. In Jesus' name, amen.